So it is, oh wow, it's 11.59 on Saturday, February 20th, and I am just starting my room. Like, I'm starting the decoration process. I don't know how long it's gonna take me to get my room to be exactly how I want it to be, but we're gonna figure that out. Um, my little cousin and I just taped up the wall that I'm gonna make my accent wall. I'm thinking about having two, but is it an accent wall if there's two of them? Hmm. So my color scheme is navy blue gray, black white, which is like the neutral tones, and then I'm thinking like gold and, or like mustard yellow accents, maybe in like a chair or a throw pillow or something like that. So that's kind of the vibe I'm going for. Um, but yeah, we're gonna start with the wall that we just kind of taped, and we're gonna go from there. We're gonna put fun of paint. <laughs> Honestly, this better. This better turn out looking like okay. Um, so yeah, we can get started. Uh, I got this is the color. I don't know if you can see that. You know how they like put it and then they do the whatever they do. This is the color that I'm going with for my accent wall. It's a dark navy blue. Um, I'm hoping this is enough. Even if I do decide to do like a second wall. Again, I got a bigger paint of this because I think I'm gonna need it. I'm definitely gonna need it if I'm gonna do this one. I did decide to do this wall too, so I'm hoping to get both of those done today. But I think for a first go, it's not bad. We're just gonna we're just gonna like do another coat and really, really, really solidify it. I really do like the color though. I'm really happy with what I chose. Um back to work. I'm just waiting for this first coat to dry so that I can do the second coat so I can go home. I think two walls is all I have in me for one day. But um, it's almost dry, I think. The corners anyways need to dry still. But then just do the second coat and then I'm out of here. I'm pacing out. Ugh, I'm exhausted. The next day. Hey guys, so it is, let's say, it's Sunday. It's, oh, it's five o'clock on the dot. And I just got here because I was exhausted last night. I woke up extremely sore. Like I'm talking fingers, hamstrings, back. Like painting a room is a workout. And then I took a nap after church because it was necessary, okay? So, but I'm back and I'm really excited to take the tape off. I'm really excited to see these lines. I think they're gonna be sharp. And if they're not, I'm gonna be salty. Okay. Same. Okay, so the lines aren't as sharp as I would like. I'm um, like, you can see kind of where it bleeds through. No, you can't. Let me show you kind of where it bleeds through. But you can see little spatches that kind of hit the wall next to it. And I am not a fan. So after putting tape in this entire wall, what time is it? 
618. I, I don't think I'm gonna finish painting today. I'm gonna try, but I think two coats of this is gonna take me a while, and then this wall is literally just this big. So, um, okay then. going home it's 9 38 and I'm super tired like my body is very very sore each wall has like one coat of paint and then this one has one and a half coat of paint I just think I'll finish it tomorrow because if not I don't really want to drive it's, it's dark outside I hate driving at night as it is I want to go home and then I thought about sleeping here last night but there's nowhere to sleep in this this is not how I want to spend my first night in this house. So, I'm gonna go. Oh no! <gasps> Ruben! Oh, I'm gonna murder him. Um, so I'm gonna go and then come back tomorrow and finish it off with some other things. Tomorrow. Oh my goodness, you guys. <sighs> what a day. Um, but I'm done. The walls are officially painted. I I feel like I did a pretty good job for somebody who doesn't paint. Like, I'm realizing how hard, <laughs> like I have mad respect for people who do this every day. Like, my body hurts and I only did four walls, so absolutely not. Jesus did not call me for manual labor. Um, but kudos to those who are able to do this thing. No, 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 not I. Um, but they're done, I really like them. And right now all I have to do is put these back on on the outlets and the light switch. I've also tried to get rid of the carpet stains by using um, white vinegar and dish soap. That didn't quite work out, so I'm gonna let it dry and then try nail polish remover. Cause I hear, I hear. I, Google told me that that might work, so we're gonna try that next. Um, and I also need to remove the second bar of my closet cause I don't really need two bars. Um, and I'm also thinking about painting my closet black. Is that weird? Like a black closet? Like I looked up on Google to, Google to kind of see what that would look like. And the only thing that I came up with like black wardrobes, which isn't it. I want like when I open it to just be black closet. And I'm not a, like a, is that weird? Black closet or not? Nah? Um, but either way, but that's not a now time. I'm taking the multiple spots of blue paint on my beige carpet as a sign to stop painting and keep it pushing. Um, my bedding did arrive today though, but to the other house, so hopefully tomorrow we'll bring it here and I can assemble it. Assemble. Assemble it. Assemble. Assem assem assemble. No, that's not it. Assemble. Assem mm. Assemble. I can put it together <laughs> and then we'll get started and then hopefully my mattress comes pretty soon so that I can have my first night here. I also need to go get, I need to go to Ikea. Ugh, I still have a lot to do. Um, but for now, we're done painting. I just have to clean up all of, um, can you see that? Whoa. All that, I gotta clean up all that. All right. Deuces. We're just gonna leave that for somebody else to do. Great. Ow. Oh. I'm done here for today. I'm gonna go home. I'm tired. All the little outlets are back though. The room's clean-ish. Tomorrow I think I'll, I'll um, tomorrow I think I'll just clean and hopefully set up my bed frame. It's super heavy, so it's gonna be a struggle to get it up here, but hopefully it works out. And then 
I want to go to like, I want to do some shopping for some of these stuff tomorrow as well. Three days. It took me three days to paint four walls. We don't need to talk about that. Alrighty then. in my room um, but before I go to Ikea and see if I can buy like a hundred dollar desk I'm gonna see if I can repurpose this desk I was using in my office at the old house and see if it'll work for my needs um, I'm gonna remove all of this stuff because I don't like like it has like things I'll show you hold on like this because I won't need it and then this as well because it hinders my foot situation so we're gonna try and clean this up I don't know if I should paint it or, or do something else with it because originally in my mind I had a white desk but if I can if I can make this into something that I like we might fork with that idea let's see One eternity later. What in the world was that? I've, I've never been to Ikea before, so this was my first time. And I promise you, this store was trying to keep me in there forever. I spent 20 minutes just trying to find my way out. All the exit signs were not pointing towards the exit. Make, make that make sense. Like it made like the exit sign was like, a lot of them were literally pointing to walls. And I was like, hmm, that's interesting. I had to ask how to get out twice. The first time this led me to that warehouse where everything's in a box. Oh my God, that was super stressful. So I didn't even find anything I liked at Ikea, especially, Ikea's expensive. I didn't think Ikea would be that expensive. So we, I scratched that and instead I stuck with what I know. So I went to TJ Maxx and Marshalls and I got a couple things, mini haul real quick. So first, what I'm really super excited about is this back pillow. It's so soft. I love back pillows. Um, I rely on them when I'm in bed, especially since the bed that I got doesn't have a uh, doesn't have bed frame, and it's the like the mustard color that I want to accent things with. And oh my goodness, it's so soft. Absolutely in love. And then I got this lamp. Um, the lamp that I wanted, really, really, really wanted, is like a lamp on Amazon, the, and it was it was pretty pricey. And the only thing is. The, like this part of the lamp is made out of glass and I don't know if I'm adult enough <laughs> for a glass lamp. Like I drop my current lamp all the time so I didn't want to spend that much money on a lamp that was literally going to break because I know the kind of person I am. So I didn't do that. But I found this one and I really like this one especially since it also has like that gold, gold detail and I love this frame that it has going on here. Absolutely adore. And then I got my comforter. I want a white comforter. I want when I walk into my room and I see my bed, it's just like brightness and welcoming. So I got a white comforter and it has like this detail on it. I don't know if you can see that or not, um, but I think that texture is gonna add a lot to the room. So I'm excited about that. It, come, it also comes with like throw pillows, which aren't my thing because I I don't wanna have to remove things when I'm going to sleep. Like that's not, that's not me. Um, but my mom wants them so she can have them. And then, I don't want to move it because it was heavy and I had my dad bring it in. I got this pillow. That's not a pillow. I got this mirror with the gold on the side, a full length mirror. I'm so excited. Um, I'm psyched about this. I really, really am. Um, and I'm loving all the gold accents that's going on here. Look at you. That's you. Is that you? No, that's not you. Uh, but yeah. That's what I got. And I'm honestly, I really didn't do much today in terms of like getting the house ready. Um, I'm still not sure about the table and there was this chair at Marshall's that I'd seen this morning when I went back there today 
it was gone i was so sad so i think i'm gonna look for a chair i think i might keep the table honestly honestly i think i might keep the table just for now and see how it works out and if it doesn't i'll get a new one i'm thinking maybe white i also don't want to do anything to the table like i don't i don't want a project i'm tired um but yeah keeping the table i'm gonna look into the only two things i need are a chair for the dust in here and a nightstand and then maybe a second lamp like a smaller lamp for the desk we'll see and decorations 